so no minor league games at all tomorrow. So that backs us up a little bit. So he'll play. We're still working out exactly where we're trying to get the most convenient spot, but he'll play in a rehab game on Monday. If all goes well there, he'll fly out to and meet us in Anaheim on Tuesday with the idea that he'll be an active player for us Wednesday. Anyone else? Dan? Oh. We were close. <laughs> we were actually close. Um, just You gave Judge a, a DH day. How do you think he's holding up physically? Uh, good, and and I'll try and probably get Judge another DH day or, or or two even on the on the West Coast swing to just try and you know pick spots for these guys. Obviously, with some of the injuries we've had, leaning on guys, but still got to be mindful of the fact that it is a long haul, and we got to pick our spots with especially the guys that we lean on so heavily. Meredith. Luke Voigt has done a nice job getting on base the last 30 yeah. games. What's been the key for him during that stretch? Um, you know, it's really been what one of the things that I think we identified with him that we like from the get-go, and that's his ability to control the strike zone. So, um, you know, especially as he's found finding his way in the early season here, I um, feel like he's hit a lot of balls hard for into some tough luck, but continues to do a pretty good job of controlling the zone, which allows him to um, have those really competitive at-bats even when he's kind of finding his way. And uh, it's it's something he's really good. And, and the pitch he was able to lay off last night uh, in, a, in, a, in, you know, a big spot, a 3-2 count there, um, those are kind of the separators with with really good hitters sometimes. Brendan. Uh, Andy Har threw the bases yesterday. Mm -hmm. Were you able to check in on, on him today and see how he recovered from that? No, I saw him, um, he, and he's doing well. So um, he is, uh, you know, we continue to be optimistic there. Uh, he'll head down to Tampa this week and continue, and hopefully uh, we can get him back to, to where he needs to be to be a player for us. Joel mentioned Sanchez you now have a hopeful date for Andujar is going to Tampa are you allowing yourself to think about the faucet being open and getting guys back instead of having to do it that way and what it might mean for you well I, I, I certainly I mean I'm invested in, in in what's going on with these guys and, and keep up on it um, so yeah I mean you start to look forward to getting getting the cavalry back a little bit and getting guys slowly but surely healthy and and you know feel like we're close obviously with Gary hopefully you know John Carlo continues to make the progress he's making and and he's he can be around the corner Aaron's doing doing well um you know with Tulo seems to be moving in the right direction and 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 obviously if we continue to make progress with Miggy I mean you know some stuff's out there on the horizon and um but in the meantime you know we're we're in the fight right now and and we got to take care of business